I'll, I'll tell you this. I, I watched Mandalorian so religiously, and I have like Mandalorian like merch. Like I'm a big fan. Like I've got like tank tops and like I got a helmet in the other room. Like I'm I'm really into it. I dig it. And uh I saw Mandalorian coming a mile away. I didn't watch a single episode. Haven't seen it, haven't even smelled a whiff of the reviews. I don't need to know because I saw pictures of the Mandalorian and I could beat him to death. If you gave him, if you put him in his Mandalore armor and he kicked my door in right now, I'd beat him to death with whatever I, that tripod that that camera's on right now. <laughs> I could kill that actor in his full armor, armor with give him that staff or whatever the that, Almost that chunky elderly get yeah, right? there at 4 p.m. for dinner because it's seven dollars off. Guy, in, in some ways, he did kill the mountain. I don't know why. Dude, that old country no, 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 no. coupon no, 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 bringing no, no. bitch. That's you're thinking the Mandalorian. I don't want to fuck. I'm not fucking with the Mandalorian. He's slick with it. That guy's probably actually taking about the actor uh, Pedro Pascal. No, I'm talking about I'm talking about Boba Fett. Boba Fett. Oh, uh, yeah, the I old mean, guy. Yeah, he's it, it, doing action and he's clearly bulging out of the armor and they have uh, a Ming Na Wen, uh, Fennec Shan. He's like trying to pose and be cool, like standing straight up doing the mm -hmm. single handed pistol shot. It's a real iconic like pose you Boba can Fett take, you. It, you know, for, for not for Boba Fett, for like action, right? Man mm -hmm. standing, holding gun. It's very okay. iconic. There's a lot. There's a few ways to do it and it, it looks good from various angles. He's trying to do one where shoulders are back, uh, chest is forward. He's like this. The problem is when he does that, he doesn't present his chest and shoulders back like, you know, big superhero man. He's got a, a bulging gut. He's got a pl an, a plate of armor yeah. that is powerful. No, yeah. The armor isn't wide enough to cover his his love handles. No, the, it, nor there's a be. scene there. I, 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 I saw this. Someone linked me a gif uh, or a gif, if you prefer, where he's mm. getting like accosted him and like his his like Asian assassin friend who was cool. I'd rather watch her show. I bet she's cool in his show. Um, I, but because I, I liked her in the Mandalorian, the Asian assassin lady. Yeah, they're like uh, getting she's a, in a lot of stuff. Uh, she's also in uh, the Street Fighter movie. She's um, ah, oh, who's the legs? Uh, Chun Li in that one. Okay. Okay. Wait, Kyle, are you gonna draw this back to Lord of the Rings, or are you just making a Mandalorian comparison? Oh, we're, we're we're shifting gears. No, like I'm I'm just talking about like I can I can smell a rat coming. I can smell a rat coming, and 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 I'm not gonna watch a single episode of Lord of the Rings unless it's like <laughs> one of those things where everybody's freaking out. It, it, you know, it's like oh, it's like taking over pop culture, and it's like everybody's like saying quotes from it. If that happens, I'm like, oh, oh Kyle was wrong again, and I'll jump on board, right? But I'm just if, telling yeah. you. If it's so very, the question is, did y'all watch Boba Fett? No, I like, no. I mean, Toronto I, was fatter I, than Boba Fett. That guy Gina looks Carano, like he's 62 years old. For, that guy is 62 years old, and and Gina Carano in the first season, she got fatter. She was she was okay, I thought. Yeah, but it season. all went to her tits. Looks. Oh, <laughs> Look, I think she's still hot when she's chunky. To be fair, she's she's, she's looking pretty fucking. You ever good. seen that video of that big white trash fat woman who like smashed a Coors Light can with her big heavy tit? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like she could do that. or something. Yeah, All right, yeah it well, wasn't the man show with like Gina that. Carano is literally like a model. Never so like, like but, but look, she got too chunky to be an action star. That's all we're fucking saying around here. And that old man right there. Look, I think it's really cool that they cast him as Boba Fett. I just wish they'd done it 15 fucking years and 35 fucking pounds ago when he maybe could have done it because he is mm. not Ewan McGregor who's still like looking pretty fucking good. This dude looks old and look, this is his best shot. Notice the helmet is covering a lot of his mass. The yeah. helmet is so well positioned. Like, like, look at that big old belt. Why is that belt three inches thick? That, 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 that looks it's a lot a like that looks a lot like my belt. The fucking girdle he's wearing. <laughs> you can <laughs> see it in the show when he has it on and he's True. stretching. You can see the bulges under the these bulge. armor. You can see the breastplate. Like it'll like instead of just coming down, you know, flat, it'll go down and like angle out a bit. That's <laughs> a like titty plate. People. That's not a breastplate. That's hmm. a titty plate because that man is overweight and he's too old to play that role. And and if they're gonna like, the worst part is even when he's got the helmet on. Apparently, they're not making him like they're not like throwing a stunt double in there or some shit like because i saw that thing where like some robots were poking him with some like energy spear and he was doing some fucking like kung fu shit lock him or like grab him you know do that badass shit and it looked weak you ever see somebody work a heavy bag that can like work a heavy bag yeah or sp you know anything boxing related something under, with your hands something with combat related yeah and you're like holy shit that guy is like an athlete this guy can't do that this guy he doesn't like all the bullets in his bandolier are different 
Yeah, then I don't. None of this makes any sense. But you talk about old people and being too old to do action. If you pull the image back up. Guess how old the actress next to him is? Well, Asian people don't fucking crack, dude. She's probably 50, 50, 58. 56. Damn, she is fifty eight. Oh no, I was close. I was close. And still doing her own stunts. Wow, she's looking yeah. great. And that's uh, what she. And that's what she looks like in real life. This isn't a show with movie magic and you know filters and makeup. That's her. Taylor, 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 Taylor. Hang on. No, no, no. no I guarantee this woman looks exactly Taylor, that age in real Taylor, life. I'm fucking Taylor. around. <laughs> All right. Here's the thing, Taylor. I, I, I'm, I'm very quick to believe that sort of thing out of people. But the problem is, she's next to Craggle Rock there, and <laughs> Fraggle and, Rock. and and they've struggled to make Fraggle Rock. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's Craggle Rock. His <laughs> agro crag. Yeah, and, 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 yeah and the like, crag. I'm sure that like if there's like movery fuckery or, or Photoshop editing that can be done, it was done, and this is the best they could make this man look. Look, he's not a fucking superhero. Come on, I'm 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 not watching. I don't I don't show. dislike his face. Like I haven't seen the show, but he does like if like Boba Fett. If he's a bit if he's getting on, he's aging a bit. Like he does look like a guy that used to be very intense and used to be very fit, right? Like he's not really. Maybe, maybe it's the bald brow intensity. There this is I'm, the guy. This is the guy who played um, the character. Or look, it, it gets convoluted. Maybe the, because they're clones, and one of the clones treated a clone of his as his son. So just fuck all that convoluted nonsense aside. This guy was the character in um, the like the, the trilogy in the early two thousands. Like, like oh, he was in this that. This is trilogy. this is the guy that confused me because like they made they used him as clone material. Mm -hmm. And then, like, there's like white, black, Asian. See, I don't think this is in the future, and it's like, were, but it was all uh, gathered from this guy. Okay, look, look no, we're going to recruit this. people no, 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 no. later because the clones started dying. They're, after uh, a while, the the clones were degrading in quality, um, and, and the, the source material was. And I think maybe the 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 clone place got destroyed or something. There was a whole anyway. They had to start recruiting. There was also some political stuff going back and forth. Like one side is like clones are what we need, and the other side is like my special troop doesn't matter it's nerdy shit but later on they're recruited that's why you got like black storms troopers and stuff is there a, is there anything in the mandalorian i think it's from episode one those like cool robots they made to kill jedi that i don't think ever succeeded yes. in killing the jedi that have shields and they roll like a like a so, sand shrew from pokemon so like, not like sand shrew style but like and they go with the did you, know you not I mean? watch the mandalorian no no well i, oh, I watched oh. up until bill burr was on the scene and then I stopped. Well, there's that kill bot thing, right? The one who's like a main character almost, who's got yeah, like uh, Benny played head. by Taika. Yeah, yeah. I, I was meaning oh, like that it? more. Uh, yeah. Oh, that that's more cool. like arachnid-looking thing with the curved back, almost. No, like a serpent. no, that's some George Lucas shit that needs to stay away. That that I thought that was cool. <laughs> but also, the last time I saw those movies, my I remember my main takeaway was that General Grievous was the coolest thing ever. Yes, because I was For like one whole 12, episode thirteen and when I saw that. Yeah, and I was like. I remember watching being like, man, that's going to be a damn shame if Yoga takes or My, Yoda takes this guy out because he's if he's a robot. He's got four lightsabers. They're not even the bullshit, like one half ones that seem like they'd be counterintuitive. He's got four I, uh, programmed like helicopter blades just yeah. going to town. There was no excuse for him to lose to Yoda. He would buttfuck Yoda unless unless Yoda used the force, which General Grievous probably couldn't because you probably need to be alive to use the force. No, he was right? alive. Yeah, he was a cyborg. He was not a full Isn't robot. Yoda considered yeah, like he, he, he the a human, most, like second most or alien, the best swordsman. I don't know, but Yoda was. I Yoda is wise as Master Yoda and as powerful as Master Mace Windu. Uh, bad acting. <laughs> I, I like the, the trilogy and like who who is Mace Windu? Count Dooku. That's who no, it was. Mace, no, 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 Mace no, that was uh, uh, Christopher, Christopher Lee, Lee was Count Dooku, yep. and he was my favorite character, like as far as just. The intimidating presence of his nature, like he was so the booming on that the dark side. Yeah, he was so he and he played Saruman to a T. He played bad guys for like sixty five years so did well. He, I bet he did a Dracula here and there. Yes, right? yeah. no, he, he was in the old uh, Hammer Dracula films in the seventy. He would play yeah, both he, Van Helsing and Dracula in different oh, films, cool. like real I, cheap ones. I've come to realize that I think Obi Wan Kenobi is the best character in all of Star Wars. I think he's got the coolest story. Um, everybody else is a fucking like their story is either like I don't know they're, they're, it's poorly written or just like I don't like how for, it, how for it those of out. us who don't know what is Obi what is Obi Wan's story Obi Wan uh, his like uh, his master's killed at the very beginning right and he and he's this uh, responsibility yes, to Liam train, Neeson 
to train the boy is like mm -hmm. thrust upon him, like all this responsibility. He just has become like a master or whatever. And now immediately. I'm sorry, I've, I've pissed my pants and I can't keep training you. The drink has ruined my That's Jedi my skills. <laughs> <laughs> he also drinks a lot, apparently. Like you see I'm him okay in, in the that. Clone Wars and stuff, always like drinking alcohol and stuff. So, so the coolest part about him, right, is this like love story that he's got with um, that that queen from that other planet. Her name escapes me, but he's got like this. The Jedi are supposed to be like warrior monks, so he's mm -hmm. not supposed to f be falling in love with this lady. I think he could probably fuck her. I think that would be okay. But he loves this woman, and she loves him. And like, spoiler, like that does not work out because his greatest enemy kills her in front of him, the same guy that killed his master, and he has to watch her die. And her dying words are like. I always loved you, and he's like, I would have given up the Jedi Order to be with you, and they just cry, and she Does fucking dies. this happen in dies. the movies? Or no, this is Clone, Wars, Clone Wars, Clone Wars. And then, like, you know, the, so the whole... So it does happen in the movie. Oh, no, this happens in the, t in the TV series. But the, 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 the TV part. series is canonical, so yeah, it, it's canonical, it happens. So it happens. Um, so and and then yes, like it's real. Yeah, it, it's as real <laughs> as any of the rest of, the, uh, of, of Star Wars, right? But I'm just saying, his story is the best. And then, obviously, like, Losing Anakin, defeating Anakin, fight, um, the, whisking Luke away to Tatooine, being overwatching him like his entire like childhood and into adulthood, mm -hmm. and then guiding him into the Force, and and then like giving his life for him, then coming back as a Force ghost to continue to guide him. Like he's got the best story out of any of them. Luke's story's fucking lame. Anakin's story is even lamer. And the Yoda. Yoda. Yoda's, Yoda, Yoda was around for thousands of years. Yoda's a fucking anyone, quitter. Maybe Yoda's, right? a, Yoda's a fucking quitter. Is what Yoda is. Go on. I'm, I'm, I mean, he lost that one fight with the he's uh, also emperor. Short. He lost that one fight with the emperor, and then he like retired to that swamp planet for like twenty five fucking years. That Yoda's is really that. that is Luke really did that. Yoda did that. Um, probably someone else. Well, Luke went because he needed it. He needed some training, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, of course no, they all Luke do it. Did it. They they have to copy and paste the same story and over and over. So of course, <laughs> of course, Ray had to go to like a planet and train with Luke Skywalker. Fuck all yeah. that shit. Fuck all that made up dragon shit. I am going to watch the Ewan McGregor thing though. Fucking fucking Obi Wan Kenobi show when that comes out. It's it's a mini series like self. It's contained oh, like eight okay. episodes or something. Dude, it's so funny that. how I can like I can sit here and like you're talking about Star Wars and I'm like this is so stupid. I can't yeah. believe it. And meanwhile I'm like and they're not following the canon of Lord of the <laughs> Rings, and they yeah. didn't buy the rights to the Silmarillion, which means all of our beloved characters from the first age and the second age are going to be there.